currently in Aldershot. This is my hometown where I grew up, went to school, played all my fun games here, and this is now where I work. From the age of 11 to 16, I went to school here. Back then it had a different name, still the same school. Then I studied engineering at Farnborough College of Technology, just down the road. I did general engineering, both electrical and mechanical here, and also discovered the benefits of student union cider of just one pound a pint. Later did my apprenticeship in Farnham, also just around the corner from Aldershot. Back in the day, I used to ride a skateboard. In fact, this very board. You can see the action it's had from all the rail grinds I used to do. Once upon a time, I even landed an ollie kickflip and famously cleared the tennis nets with an ollie. But these days, please don't ask me to drop in. I like to ride motorbikes, not as often as I wish I could, but then I do like to, like to get out and play in the mud on my motorbike. I'm not that good at tricks. I'm too old, it hurts when I fall. A little bit of jumping, yeah, bunny hops, yeah, things like that. A friend of mine in America was working for Fath and talked to them about me. And then I got a call from Murky Amfarth, one of the two brothers, a bit of a crazy guy, but lovely. He suggested we should meet up. So he flew over to the UK to Stansted Airport. I drove up there, we had a meeting. And in 2010, Fath Components was born. What's great about working for Fath is the typical setup with all operations around the world, is you have the two Fath brothers, Murky Ann and Vido, uh, owners and shareholders, and then a person from that country, also a shareholder that runs the business as the manager director. And this makes for great fun running the business. As long as it makes profit, they let us do it. And it's really, really good. 